Hello? Hi, I was looking for David. This is he. Hi, David. My name is Seth McElroy, and I work at Visa. How are you today? I'm um, good. How are you? Good, good. Listen, we were looking at the current activity on your card. We believe that someone has compromised your account. I just need to verify some charges with you, if that's okay. Uh, yeah. What? what uh, when did this happen? Well, yesterday, uh, around 2 o'clock, someone used your card at Nordstrom to buy a $200 sweater. Oh, that... well, yeah, that was me. That was you? Yeah. Okay, you're sure about that? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, we track your spending habits, and there's nothing in your past purchasing history that says you should even be going into a store like that. <laughs> you know, it's a little more high-end than what you're used to. Yeah, no, it's okay if I go into a store like that. Thanks. I guess I'll mark the sweater purchase as accepted. Is that right? Yeah, I bought the sweater. I appreciate that you are looking out for me, but it's okay if I can spend my money the way I spend it. Um, the next charge that I wanted to talk to you about... Was the seventy five dollars at yes. restaurant? Yeah, that's not that's not you, right? That is me. Yeah, it is me. I'm sorry for being blunt, but I, did, I wouldn't even imagine they let you into a nice restaurant like that. You know, I mean, what the f are you saying? You know, I just like this is what you're paid to do. This is your job to call people. This is how you handle like fraud protection. Yeah, we just call up and verify charges. <laughs> I'm not talking about I'm not talking about we. I'm not talking about you as a company. I appreciate that. I'm talking about you as a person. This is what you think doing a good job is? Calling to, to call me up and tell me that I shouldn't be allowed in nice stores or nice re Nordstrom is like such a nice store that you think I should be turned away at the door? I I just don't want you to be offended. Our database has classified you as working poor, so it's it's not your fault. I mean, it's yeah. it's classified me as as working poor. That's a that's a level that you have on your thing. Yes, when I pull up your profile, it has a WP All right, right next to your name. All right, you know what? Poor. I want to cancel my. I'm going to cancel my. I can't with you. I don't want you guys. Oh, I'd hate for you to. I'd hate for you to do that, sir. Please don't cancel your. Really, account. I would hate for you to keep your job. You well, don't call people out of the blue and say, "Oh yeah, you look kind of like you're. Uh, you don't. Uh, you can't afford a sweater." I didn't say you couldn't afford a sweater. I said you couldn't afford that sweater. That's a two hundred dollars oh, sweater. Are you serious right now? Had you been going to another place, I don't know. It's like nineteen, twenty bucks. Probably wouldn't have been flagged. You see what I don't need to explain myself to you right now, okay? I don't need to explain why I bought that sweater at that store when I did. So, I did. That's all you need to know. Okay, we clearly, it's my credit card. It's my money. I'll spend it how I want to, all right? But if you just, you know, continue to, to live within your means and not get to... I live within my means. I live within my means. My means are none of your business. I do fine. Thank you, Seth. Okay. Don't tell me where I should be living, what should I should be shopping, or anything like that. I live within my means, I make a good living, and I take care of my family. Jesus. What is the matter with you? Sir, well, I apologize for upsetting you. Like I said, I just wanted to check on those charges. Yeah, so. I know what you just wanted to do. You've done it. Are we through? Uh, before I do let you go, sir, I need to ask you if you were satisfied with my service today. Did I, did I please you as a <laughs> Are you kidding me? Are you f kidding me? No, Did no. You listen it, to me talking to you. Well, it's a survey that we do at the end of these phone calls just to make sure that we've provided good customer Great. service. What's the lowest score you can get? Is there a check mark for angered? Is there something I could have done better to serve you? <laughs> yeah. Is there a box to mark? Don't be a douchebag. Can you put that down? The, all those suggestions are good. I'm gonna go ahead and check you down as a just been phone tapped box, though, if that's if that's okay with you. What is that? It means that this is a joke. It's actually Jubal from Brook and Jubal in the morning doing a phone tap on you. Oh, my God. Your wife, Paula, set you up. She said she was giving you a hard time for spending too much money at the mall the other day. I can't believe you did that. So now that you know it's a joke, do you want to change your customer satisfaction survey answer? Absolutely not. I'm actually still angry with you, and uh, I still want to punch you in the face.